on the throttle is brought to you by Sport Bike Wrench. Performance parts, professional advice. When I'm at the racetrack, for me, even though I do a lot of events with the media, it's more of an observational mode for me. I'm not doing the hard work up front. Now I'm in observation mode and I'm note taking. You know, how is the relationship working between the crew chief and the rider? How is my technical group solving problems that they encounter on the racetrack? How do, how do our motorcycles compare from a performance basis? How, how are the media people going out and generating interest in our team are they doing that in the right manner you know how do how are we taking care of our guests is the meal delivery proper did the crew eat on the at the right time did you know our guests eat the meal meals that were designated for the crew so I kind of constantly sit and observe that's the easy part right and then at the end of the day you go back you have a notebook and you say man this was good this was not good what can we do to make this better and that's you know it's always easy to say we need to do better. The hard part is making things better because it takes time and resource to do that. So, but that, you know, the racing part, honestly, from, from an effort standpoint, is the easy part, you know? And especially when you have the staff that you do, the guys that you have plugged in? Like yes. Yeah, I mean, we have quite a staff and, uh, you know, each person has a specific task to do and, uh, you know, that's one of the big things is, you know, personality wise, are they putting in the effort? Are they getting the job done? What are they doing between the times when they need to be a specialist? Are they still enhancing the operation, you know? So, for example, as a racer, all right, you have your on-track sessions. How do you energize and use that individual uh, in between those sessions? You have autograph signings. You have them interact with the public. You have them talk about uh, the technical aspects of the motorcycle. You have them talk to sponsors and build those relationships. You know, yesterday, for example, um, as a part of preparation, we record uh, digitally every single race. And during dinner, I broadcast it for the riders and crew to watch from a third person. As a racer, you've never seen it. The rest of the team has seen it on television. Racer's never seen it. He's only seen it from the bike perspective. The racer always watches it and the crew sits around them and then they start talking about how does the bike handle, what are the passing zones. So I optimize every single minute of every single person during the course of the day. So nobody has you know, a situation where we're wasting resource because time is money and it's resources. And if you have good people, you can maximize that. You know, at the very least, uh, you know, dealing with the public, making them feel welcome making them want to come back associating your brands with the public so interacting with people doing special things like a little kid walks by we've got baseball cards that you can only get at the racetrack made by upper deck hey here you go here's here. you know making them emotionally tied to the event and the relationships that we have with our partners so every single person matters every single minute of the event weekend